Winter has waited until the last moment to unleash massive storms south of the city. Winds of up to 100 kilometres an hour ravaged a row of homes in Ravenswood. And as Cassidy Moscone reports, there's still a final winter front on its way. Lazenby Avenue smashed apart. Smacked by a tornado that hit while most people were asleep, powerful enough that it uprooted trees. A patio destroyed. It roared through, taking out whatever was in its way. Tiles hurled from roofs. It just sounded like a freight train coming through. And I thought the roof had gone, but it was somebody else's roof from across the road. But amongst the destruction was a heartwarming display of mateship from the Ravenswood community, who pulled together to clean up what Mother Nature left behind. It's just incredible how everyone's rallied together from the crack of dawn and... There's people here helping that we don't even know. I think you would have done if they didn't. Probably sat down and cried. I just do not know what we would have done without them. Residents here have already taken dozens of trailer loads of fallen branches to the tip. They say it'll take them all weekend to clean up the devastation. There were warnings overnight that something was brewing. Ravenswood wasn't the only town hit hard. Parts of Rockingham were smashed too. Winds so forceful it ripped away this hot water system and sent it hurling into a neighbour's yard. Another home's shed destroyed. The worst of the megastorm hit around 11.30 last night during a severe weather warning that spanned all the way from Perth to the bottom of the state. We're not in the clear yet. One final winter front is on its way, expected to lash the southwest by mid-morning tomorrow. Then it's Perth's turn in the afternoon. Cassidy Moscone, 7 News.